y'all. Good morning. Okay, so I know you guys have already seen me in this sweatshirt yesterday, okay? And uh, you guys have probably seen the silk scarf, scarf a million times over. It's my way of kind of laying my edges down because it's silk and it kind of keeps it from uh, losing moisture. Anywho, how's everyone doing? Hope everyone's having a great day. It's Friday. So happy it's Friday, y'all. So happy the weekend is here. Um, anyway, it is breakfast time. I'm about to have me some, bam, eggs like a mother sucker. And we're boiling them again. I know, it's gonna get better. Um, anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the question and answer um, the other day from, I think yesterday's vlog, I think is what it is. Um, don't forget we have that health and fitness group, so definitely make sure to hit up my Facebook fan page and um, you know let me know if you guys wanna be a part of the health and fitness group on Facebook and I'll send you the link so that you can request to be added to the group. So don't forget about that. Um, yeah, so today is Friday, Juice is at the J-O-B-B, -B, and I'm at the Crizib. I got a bunch of errands to run today, some random things. Um, I don't know, we'll see what the day brings, we'll see. But, you're gonna see a lot of repeats food-wise today, more than likely, because, um, we have to get rid of the salmon that's in the fridge, and we have like a little bit left of it, I don't want it to spoil, so today's probably gonna be the last day that we eat the salmon, and so we're gonna finish that up, and uh, we still have just a few other miscellaneous items. I think we're out of the chicken strips, so probably gonna go by the store and maybe pick up a few more little miscellaneous things, meat-wise or whatever. May go to Trader Joe's to get it. We'll see. If not, I'll make a trip to Sam's over the weekend. Today, if you guys have been following us for a while, uh, you guys may or may not know, but Fridays, we always stay home for the most part. We really don't go out on Friday nights. Um, Juice goes after work, gets his hair cut, and then we come back home and uh, just chill. We watch movies typically or watch TV or whatever. And we always order Outback. It's been our thing forever. Um, they know us up in there to the point where they know our order when I call it in or he calls it in. And um, we know all the servers, you know, that deal with the, um, you know, carry out or whatever. Um, and we usually order some really bad fatty uh, dinner. Yeah. So. We always have a bottle of wine. Juice usually has an entire bottle himself. Keep in mind, he's not a lush. It's just um, a really cheap old bottle of wine, Le Bourgeois. You guys are probably familiar with us um, always talking about that wine. But anyway, um, <laughs> we usually have that on Fridays. But you guys already know, we can't drink for two weeks. So we can't have any liquor, including wine. And we can't have, obviously, our Outback Steakhouse meal that we normally have. Anyway, it's Friday. Hope everyone had a great week. And I guess we start today off doing our thug dizzle. Yeah, I mean, no of, uh, I think chicken and vegetables too. Okay, I'll have to take some uh, chicken out. Hold up. Why? Why do you want to? Why in the world do you want to? Do you want to talk to Kit again? We, it's only day four. Four, right? Oh, you gotta bump me up a little bit. No, this is uh, not enough. <laughs> <laughs> Juice, are you sure it's not because you're just hungry? I mean, is, is, are you sure it's not because you're just, you know, you are um, bored with what you're eating? Hungry and bored, yeah. You said what? <coughs> hungry and bored. You are not hungry, dude. We eat uh, every two and a half hours. Yeah, but not enough. Mm -hmm. You know, it's it's not going to get, I mean, it's not like he's going to, um, you know, make a meal plan that's, you know, going to have all these tasty things in it that we're accustomed to eating. You just got to get used to eating how we're eating. Well, I just need a bigger snack. Like what? Juice, how much? <laughs> okay, so how much more of a snack do you need for a snack? Uh, I'll let him tell me that because it just needs to be bigger. Mm. Mm -hmm. It just needs to be bigger. Or it might just be because you're accustomed to eating a certain way and you're going through withdrawal. Or it could be that it needs to be bigger. Everybody's different. Oh, God. Hilarious. Okay, y'all for real have me cracking the hell up at your comments on the bottom of the latest vlog. I think this is from day two. Y'all cracking me up. Uh, Slicker Ronnie, Roni, I hope and pray to God I'm saying that correctly, uh, says, Juice looks like he's dancing on that step with them spirit fingers. Girl, cracking my shit up right now. Here is my breakfast. Okay, I know if you guys, a few of you guys were asking about, or a couple of you guys were asking about the wheatgrass. Actually, I'm supposed to have five of those. So let me take 
and show you guys the wheatgrass tablets that we get. These we do get from Whole Foods. They're the only place that we know of to get them. One, two, three, four, five. I'm supposed to have five. You're actually, let me show you the canister so you can see it. This is the canister or the container for the wheatgrass tablets that we get. We get these from Whole Foods. They also have a smaller container, but because Juice and I both take wheatgrass every day, um, we get the one with 200 tablets in them because basically each serving size of wheatgrass is five tablets, which you'll see right here. They're the green tablets. And basically you can take several servings a day of this stuff. And if you look at the back, it kind of gives you an idea of exactly what it does. Um, so helps with a lot of different things. Um, wheatgrass has a whole bunch of benefits. So anyway, we just started taking wheatgrass um, earlier this year and we absolutely love it. So anyway, Whole Foods, that's where we get them from. It's the only place we know of to get it. And we don't want to drink the pure wheatgrass because it's disgusting. So that's what we do. And then the other stuff, this is a B12 tablet right there. This is also from Whole Foods. Um, this is a vitamin C tablet. I take a couple of those a day. And this is just a daily vitamin with iron. So I take a lot of vitamins. This is just a little bit of the vitamins I typically take. I take ginseng um, and a lot of other stuff too. So I just have to restock my vitamins. So when I do, I'll show you what vitamins I take. What's up, y'all? Okay, my bad. I meant to be shooting the other meals that I had earlier today, but honestly, your girl got into the bills and was all in that computer. So anyway, got some bills done, so it took a little while, and then I had some emailing to do, and then I had some more emailing to do, and a couple more bills, and totally got sidetracked. But I can say that I had similar things that I had the other day. I had my cottage cheese and grapes and stuff. I just was kind of like in between trying to get back to finish everything because I was like right in the middle of doing the monthly bills that I totally forgot to pick up the camera and shoot what I ate. But I did have grapes and cottage cheese. I had my breakfast as you guys saw earlier. Um, I'm about to have, I don't know what I'm about to have. I don't know if I should wait a little bit because my day was a little off today since I was all in that computer. Um, yeah, Juice is on his way home here in a little bit. He went to go get his haircut he always does on Fridays so <clears throat> he should be here soon and then we're going to decide ultimately what we're going to eat. I just thought about the fact that today is regularly the day that we would go get out back like I had said earlier. A lot more food and a lot more unhealthy food is typically what we get and I was thinking to myself I was like oh yeah we can probably get something from out back because we have a gift card and I was thinking okay we could probably get something but the, here's the here's the kicker everything is portion control so I only have four ounces of meat and he has six although he's gonna call the nutritionist because he's saying that as you guys saw earlier in the phone call <laughs> he's saying that he's hungry and so <laughs> he's gonna uh, text um, Kit and find out if there's anything that he can change um, at least for now because he says he's feeling hungry all the time anyway personally I think it's withdrawal but he's a big man so you know men it doesn't take anything to drop a couple pounds so he's all good anyway so um, I'm four ounces at least for right now and six for juice so far. In other words, anything that we got get from Outback, we're going to end up having to cut in its portion size to eat. So what's the point of ordering? You know what I'm saying? I'm not going to even lie either. I'm not hungry. Okay, it's not that I'm hungry. I'm just craving now. So now I'm like day four. I'm craving like crunchy things still like I was the first day. I don't have the dry mouth and all that stuff like I was before. But I'm like craving stuff. Like normally when you get the munchies or you just want something to kind of snack on when you're doing work on the computer, my first tendency is to like grab a little handful of Cheez-Its or grab some salsa and chips or, you know, make a little bit of crackers and some cheese. And I don't have that, that, that thing I want you know I don't have the crunch factor involved in this at all yet except for breakfast when I have toast or whatever so um yeah having a little withdrawal in the sense of just not having that um type of food available to me right now I'll get over it you know I'm determined we finna get it in um I was gonna go to class tonight and work out but we have a training session with Jessica in the morning and um I thought Juice would be back in time so we could go together but we opted out of it because he's gonna still be getting his hair cut so Tomorrow, we're going to be working out with Jessica at 11 a.m., so you'll be able to see us get our workout on with her as well. Yeah. So, yeah, that's it. Just having cravings, and, uh, yeah, I'm chewing on some gum to help me forget. So, yeah. All right, this Negro is on his way home. He should be home any minute. So, we're making the last of the salmon because I don't want it to go bad. Of course, that's my portion. This is juices. Really, this is more than six ounces, but I know 
I don't want to waste the salmon. So he's probably just, he's going to eat it, at the whole thing. I know he is. He's been complaining about how hungry he is. And I don't want him to get grumpy. So I'm just going to make him the food. I don't know if Kit told him to try larger portions of meat. I have a feeling he's going to tell him to eat more veggies, but whatever. So um, this is probably about a 7 ounce portion or 8 ounce portion of fish. These collectively together. But look, happy hubby, you know, happy wifey, okay? It doesn't just apply to the females, you know what I'm saying. Anyway, I'm going to have that with um, some asparagus. So I'm going to um, change it up a little bit because I'll be getting bored. Instead of doing our usual little vegetable medley, we are eating some asparagus. I totally like straight rigged this. Like, I'll have to show you if you guys want to, um, if you guys want me to show you how I season this asparagus let me know but I totally just kind of made something up and it's super flavorful it's a little spicy so juice may not like it but I love it it's so good anyway and we're having our fish bam it's actually done oh let me not mess with this lens and there we go all right let's see what juice is doing what you doing huh what you doing what's wrong huh what's wrong I'm hungry me too <laughs> yeah. Honey, I'm hungry. Me too. Come on. Can you come out the shower? I'm like eating asparagus. It's so good. Alright, you're working on it. Can you do a little dance for me though? No. On your way out the door? Yeah. Alright, y'all. Here is the finished product. We're gonna put it under the light so y'all can see it. I have become a chef, man. I don't know. I make up some stuff and it works, so. Anyway, I'm tired of waiting for this Negro, so I'm finna eat. <laughs> Man, I twerked the fuck out of them damn mushrooms and asparagus, y'all. I don't know what I just made, but that was so delicious. I like stuffed my face with the asparagus to the point where I've got my salmon left, which is usually what I eat last. I mean, usually what I finish first, but I never finish the veggies first. Just wait till you see, taste that asparagus. Oh. All right. The mushrooms actually taste better than the asparagus. It's so good. I'm going to load up on those. Then. Oh, my God. By the way, have you said hello yet? What's up? What up? Juice went right to the shower. He was starving when he got home. Day four. Yeah, buddy. Almost in the book. Yeah, buddy. He's already been complaining, though. He's starving. So, anyway. Here comes the Negro. Watch out, water. There's water. Young, you. Hey, diggers. Yep. This is it. Hello. My delicious bites. Yeah. That is not a bite, by the way. And that's not measured. That's the whole serving of fish because I knew you were fiending. So I just gave it to you. Because... I skipped my snack because so. I forgot it. So I'm making up for it right now. Mm-hmm. So, uh. Let move, me know what you think move, of the... Move that shit out the way. Taste the... Motherfucker. <laughs> uh, taste the... Try a mushroom. Bit. Just try a mushroom first. It's so good. Yeah. <laughs> We're looking at the comments from last night's vlog, and uh, I just informed Juice that y'all... Damn, I have food on my face. I was grubbing. Anyway that y'all were cracking up at his spirit fingers when he was doing the step up. <laughs> y'all think that's funny? That shit was hilarious. Oh, what you gonna do? What you gonna do? What you gonna do? What you gonna do? Coming after everybody. <laughs> you ain't gonna once do I get done, Once I get in shape, I'm coming after everybody. Is that, what, is that right? Yeah, once I get in shape in about... What? Three and a half, four more weeks. I'm coming for you. Oh, for real? Yep. It's like that? Yeah. You have to admit that shit was funny. One by one. You have to admit that was funny. <laughs> All right. I mean, I'm, I'm reading these, right? Hold up. <laughs> hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Styled by Yvonne said... Juice was killing it with the fingers. He had those spirit fingers. Style by Yvonne. Mm-hmm. Four weeks. Look at me. Watch your back in four weeks, all right? 
<laughs> Hold up. <laughs> Miss I Art. M I S S I. I mean, M M M I S S I. Oh my God. M I S S E Y E Art. She said, Juice Hands made me spit out my juice. Laugh out loud. That man looked as if he had to get it perfect. Laugh out loud. <laughs> Is it Miss Hart? What's her name? Miss I Heart. Oh, Miss I Heart. Okay. And where'd she live again? Oh, we don't know. Okay. Miss I Heart, let me know where you live. <laughs> and uh, I just want to make a delivery. That's all. Just let me know where you live. And I'll drop something off for you, okay? Oh, for real? Yeah, let me know. Hold up. I think we have another one. Hold up. Velocity1913 says, Laugh my ass off. Juice and them hands, child. I hollered. Laugh out loud. Uh, what's her name again? Velocity... Velocity one nine no what you just <laughs> Velocity one nine one three Velocity uh huh nineteen ninety three no yeah. one nine one three oh one nine one three see I'm hearing things y'all I'm so <clears throat> I'm so low on sugar oh my god shut up with the sugar. I'm hallucinating <laughs> whatever shut up with the damn sugar oh slicker Roni. Okay, Slipper she home. says Bet. Juice looks uh -huh. like he's dancing on that step with them spirit fingers. That's funny as hell. Mm -hmm. That okay. shit is funny as hell. Y'all are a trip. Tell Slickeroni, <laughs> I'll make a personal, <clears throat> I'll personally come dance on her steps. Give me her address. <laughs> and tell her, give me four weeks and her address. He just salty. Anyway. Bet. How's it taste? Is it good? It's good. Mm -hmm. What'd you think of the, um, did you taste the mushroom? Good. Wasn't it delicious? Mm hmm you good. I twerked the hell out of them things, didn't I? Mm -hmm. I, need, I needed this. Man, and then it feels like you eat, you're eating a lot. Because yeah. that's a lot. I mean, I put a lot of asparagus in there. And then after it cooked down, like, the, you know, they reduce, it didn't even seem like a ton. You know what I'm saying? I mean, it didn't seem like anywhere near as much. This, this is good. What show is that? Oh, this is Kevin Hart, isn't it? My God, this Negro is everywhere. Y'all, Kevin Hart is blowing the hell up. I love me some Kevin Hart, by the way. Um, <laughs> like love uh, me some Kevin Hart. That's my naga. You hear me? <laughs> he is everywhere. He's got a show on BT. I think this is Comedy Central. Bless Man, you. Man, you ain't gonna bless me. <laughs> I just said bless you. I was a little tardy for the party. I was finishing a sentence. Whatever. Anyway, um, he is everywhere. And but I'm so proud of him, dude. I watched him back in the day, day when he was first starting out, and now he's just. Taking it to, you know, soul playing days. Even before that, I was watching him when he was doing his little stand-up acts. You know, where he would do random shows on television. And then he just blew up overnight. Dope. Yeah. Sick. I love his style, too. Kind of reminds me of Juice. Like, his physique is a little bit like Juice. But just really short. <laughs> but anyway, he's doing the damn thing. Um, what's that? Anybody know what the real housewives of whatever, what is it called? Real Husbands of whatever it's called. What, what is that about on BET? Anybody know. know that? Let us know. Because we've seen these really funny teasers with Kevin Hart in it and Nick Cannon and whatever. But, like, I'm wondering, what is it? Like, is it a real? It's not a reality show, obviously. I'm assuming it's just a sitcom spoof. I don't know. Yeah, it might be. Anywho. <laughs> yeah. Oh. About to chill with this hubster of mine. You all right, babe? Allergies? We might need to get a humidifier for you. Huh? <laughs> you know what? I'm going to ask y'all. You guys let me know. Do you know? <laughs> Bless you, babe. He has really bad allergies. And at night, because we have the heat on, he has a, um, he gets like dry nose or whatever. And so he wakes up in the morning just, you know, with a super dry nose and, and that kind of thing. But I think we might need a humidifier for him just because of his allergies and blah, blah, blah. Let me know if any of you guys have allergies like this what you guys do, um, and if you guys use a humidifier or whatever the case. Anyway. Bless you. Here's my dog. Bam. That's his little chill place. Anyway. All right. All right, y'all. So, uh, normally we would both close out, but uh, take a look. My poor baby and his allergies. Yeah, my poor baby. He's um 
got the sniffles. It's really just his allergies acting up, and he's been sneezing the entire time. So um, I might just see if I could find him some medicine, and uh, he's going to go to sleep. I'm going to turn down this um, light, too. You'll notice we always have dim light, typically, when we're here on the couch. And um, anyway, part of that is he just doesn't like light. It's just his thing. He doesn't mind it in the kitchen, but in the family room, he likes it to be almost pitch black. So anyway... I had the light on only because we're, you know, shooting or whatever, but I'm about to turn it down. So anyway, y'all, sorry, I don't even know how, I don't know how today was. I don't know. Um, but yeah, normally he'd be awake right now. It's pretty, actually, pretty early considering it's a weekend and he's dead asleep. So, or at least trying to sleep. So anyway, I guess I'm just going to watch TV by myself. It's Okay reruns or something or I'll try to catch a, a flick or something like that but anyway hope you guys had a great Friday night by the time you guys see this no today's Friday night so by the time you guys see this it'll probably be Sunday anyway um I hope you guys had a great weekend if you guys are watching this it'll probably be about after the weekend is up and yeah I guess we will see y'all tomorrow bye